Hi, in this video we will see how to work with the timeline to create an animation. So first we need to show the timeline tool and we click on window right here. Then we check the timeline. Now we can create animations and videos. To create your first video, you click right here, create video timeline. As you can see, we have this layer 0, which is the same layer right here. And if we rename it, we call it background. It will be renamed to so we can create new layers and we'll create shape let's say circle now we will add an animation to this circle So to animate this circle, we will use the timeline tool. We have Eclipse 1 right here. We click on this arrow to show more options. So you make one click and you find position, opacity style, vector mask position and vector mask enabled. So what we do now is to precise the first position and the add position. We can even change the length of the timeline for now we have 5 seconds so now we click on opacity to initiate the opacity effect So this is the first one, we have 100 and in the second position I want it to be 10% so I move the mouse and I change its value to 10. So we will play the video and as you can see the opacity is changing by time. So we will add now another opacity. I want it to go back to 100. So we will play the video again. We can even apply more effects like the position. So I want to add a transition effect by using vector mask position. So we initiate the first position, then we move the shape to 
and photoshop will apply the effect on the final position so now we'll play the video so it's transparent then 100 and it's moving so this is how you can create animations and video with the timeline tool of photoshop thank you for watching